we're going to have another look at SFTP, but this time in a GUI interface. Last time I showed you how to log on to an SSH server using secure FTP, so you can transfer files back and forth as you would with an FTP server, if that is something you're used to doing. Uh, but if uh, you're in Linux, uh, I'm using GNOME, so Nautilus is my file manager. Uh, so I can't say, I haven't really tested this out in other file managers, although I'm sure a lot of the uh, Linux file managers will do this or something similar to this. But basically, I'm going to go to my location bar here, and I'm going to hit SSH. You can actually type SFTP, but I usually do SSH just because that's how I do it. Colon forward, sort, colon forward slash forward slash, and then you can type the name of the user you want to log in as and then the IP address that you want to log into. It will then prompt you for a password and it will ask you if you want to forget the password immediately, remember password until you log out, or remember forever. I'll just forget it immediately. I'll connect. You can see it automatically changes to SFTP up here in the location bar. And you're logged into the root directory and you can go through the files here and you can take files and copy them and you can drag them or copy and paste them into folders on your local machine. Um, so that is how you log into a SSH server as a secure FTP in a GUI interface such as Nautilus in the GNOME desktop environment. Uh, once again, very simple to do. Uh, I did put the username here. If you just did SSH colon forward slash forward slash and the IP address without the uh, username it will prompt you for the username when it prompts you for the password so it's just two different ways of doing it um, that's pretty much it uh, have fun visit filmsbychris.com for more video tutorials like this